The name of the Daisy Phase Production Company of Syracuse, New York, comes with a little joke. I feel like I'm always in a daze, right? <laughs> if that's true, it's the kind of daze you get when you're focusing on many things all at once. Syracuse native Jake Casey started the company with his sister Eva during the pandemic when Jake came home from a career as a dancer and actor in New York. Rise and shine. Today they're trying to help get financing and distribution for three main films including Egghead and Twinkie. The coming of age comedy has earned five awards on the film festival circuit, the latest in Austin, Texas. The Casey's are listed as consulting producers. They like films with humor and heart. Make them about marginalized voices, but not making them about why they're marginalized. And ultimately reach as big of an audience as we can. Next week, Jake heads to Utah's Sundance Film Festival, one of the country's premier gatherings of filmmakers. It'll give him a chance to press the flesh with folks he's only been able to connect with virtually. Jake is hoping to convince them to bring their productions to central New York and create more jobs in the growing local film industry that's gotten a big boost from American High. Well, higher profile films now are starting to really vet the area to come here because of the tax credits, because of CNY Arts being great, because of, you know, the crew, because of the proximity to New York. As a kid, Jake had to leave town to chase his dreams and find work in the arts. He hopes now to be able to make a difference for others. There's a lot, of, a lot of hope out here, I think, from creatives in this community to have something to hold on to. And American High has sort of laid out that rubric really well. Jake hopes Daisy Phase can help with the next phase. I'm Tim Fox, News Channel 9. And tell us something good. If you've got a great story worth sharing, send an email to something good at localesquire.com or post to social media. Just use the hashtag something good. SYR.